Are you looking for best places to live in the United States in 2021 or perhaps the best places to live in North Carolina? North Carolina is number five on the top inbound states in 2020, according to NorthAmerican.com. The link to that article is below. With the number of people migrating to North Carolina, I believe this, this will happen again this year. As everyone knows, the pandemic played a huge role in driving people out of their state and go somewhere else for a cheaper cost of living while keeping their job. Thanks to working remotely, Charlotte got two more titles from U.S. News, among the 150 best places to live in the U.S. in 2020 to 2021, Charlotte ranks number six, yes, number six in the country. And the good news is, Charlotte ranks number one city as the best place to live in North Carolina in 2020 to 2021. Now that we know Charlotte is a great place to live in North Carolina, let's deep dive on this subject matter. Charlotte is a big metro city with approximately 900,000 in population. However, in this video, I will be talking about an area north of Charlotte, which is considered suburb of Charlotte. Do you want to know those cities? Keep watching, it's right after this. Hello there, my name is Lynn Alvarez, your realtor in Charlotte, North Carolina. My husband and I work as a team, so if you have any questions about living in Charlotte, moving to Charlotte, or finding a neighborhood in the greater Charlotte, please don't hesitate to contact us. Our info is in the description bar below. If you are new here, please consider subscribing to our channel so you won't miss out the good content we upload on YouTube every week. If you're already subscribed, thank you so much for your support. According to this article in US News, 150 best places to live in the US in 2020 to 2021, Charlotte, North Carolina is number six and number one in best places to live in North Carolina. See the links to these articles on the description bar below. U.S. News analyzed 150 metro areas in the United States to find the best places to live based on quality of life and the job market in each metro area as well as the value of living there and people's desire to live there. Although there are 900,000 people in the city of Charlotte alone, the population of Charlotte metropolitan area is about 2.7 million. We are talking about all the cities surrounding areas or the suburbs of Charlotte. And today, I will be talking about the Lake Norman area, which is north of Charlotte. To give you a little background, Lake Norman is the biggest man-made lake in North Carolina. It has 49.81 square miles and 520 miles of shoreline. Now let's start with Charlotte's Ford, number six on my list as the best places to live in the Charlotte suburb. Charlotte's Ford is a small town in Catawba County with only 7.8 square miles and a growing population of 7,439. Thanks to the recent commercial developments along Highway 150 anchored by a public supermarket, Charlotte's Ford is about a 45-minute drive from Uptown Charlotte via Highway 16. It is just a few minutes to west of Morrisville and north of Denver, North Carolina. As you can see from the map, Charlotte's Ford is a town with many waterfront properties and some are currently listed for sale. This house with three bedrooms located on a deep cove year-round water with a floating dock and pier is listed at $675,000. This is a manufactured double-wide home for your information, but it doesn't look like one, right? This house with four bedrooms, three baths, 3,454 square feet is available for you to purchase at $925,000 with an amazing view of Lake Norman. Owner suite is on main floor. Non-waterfront homes are going from $354,900 with three bedrooms, two baths, 2,110 square feet, and a new construction to $450,000 with four bedrooms, three baths, 
3,215 square feet, and this house was built in 2018. Shirley's Ford has many master plan communities loaded with amenities that everyone will enjoy, and of course, one of those is Lake Norman Water Sports. For information on homes for sale in Shirley's Ford, please see the description below. The fifth city in Lake Norman that I'd like to talk about is Denver in Lincoln County. Yes, we have Denver also here, just like Denver in Colorado. It is a small town with only 5.93 square miles located west of Huntersville and northwest of Charlotte. Denver is one of the fastest growing cities in the Lake Norman area. And even though it is a small city, it's got everything the residents need. The three huge supermarkets, Publix, Harris Theater, and Food Lion are conveniently located on Highway 73 and Highway 16, as well as Lowe's Home Improvement, Walmart, restaurants, banks, gas stations, and medical and dental offices. Denver is very accessible to Uptown Charlotte and Charlotte Douglas International Airport, which takes only 35 minutes via Highway 16, and in just 15 minutes to 20 minutes, you will be in its neighboring town in Huntersville and I-77, traveling east on Highway 73. Denver is also known for many waterfront properties. This stately home that's on the market with five bedrooms, six and a half baths, 8,094 square feet is listed at $3,190,000. You will be impressed by the stunning view of the lake. And if you are looking for a more affordable home, Check this cute home out for just $245,000. If you're looking for a neighborhood to settle in a Charlotte suburb with many amenities for your family, definitely check Denver out. Let me know if you have questions about living in Denver, North Carolina. The next on my list is Morrisville in Arvidal County. It has 24.7 square miles and a population of 41,000 according to 2020 U.S. Census. The commute from Morrisville to Uptown Charlotte via Interstate 77 is about 35 minutes. Morrisville is best known as the home of many NASCAR racing teams and drivers along with an IndyCar team and its drivers as well as racing technology suppliers which has earned the town the nickname Race City, USA. The top attractions to visit in Morrisville are the Lazy Five Ranch, Penske Racing South Facility, the Pit Indoor Kart Racing, Kerrigan Farms, NC Auto Racing Hall of Fame, and Queens Landing Cruise. Morrisville is much larger than Shell's Ford and Denver combined, so naturally you can find more waterfront properties in Morrisville. There are so many outstanding waterfront communities in this desirable city, most notably the waterfront and golf community, The Point, which is also known as Trump National Golf Club, Charlotte. The homes in this neighborhood are spectacular. The most expensive home available for sale right now is this magnificent home on the peninsula with almost 10,000 square feet, six bedrooms, six full baths, and four half baths sitting on 1.4 acre of land with stunning view of Lake Norman. If you want to see all the details, price, and photos, please see the description below. For a more affordable waterfront home in Morrisville, check this out. It's a new construction with three bedrooms, three and a half baths, 2,777 square feet, and can be yours for $600. $99,900. There are non-waterfront homes for sale as well, so check out the details on the description bar below. Leave a comment below and let me know what town you would be interested in. Shellas Ford, Denver, or Mooresville. If you have any questions about places to live in North Carolina, specifically the suburbs of Charlotte, Contact me at 704-975-2429 or send me an email at lynn at lynnalvarez.com and I will be making separate videos for Charles Ford, Denver, and Morrisville. So watch out for those in the coming days. 
This video about Lake Norman top six cities is not done yet because I just talk about the three towns or cities here, Charles Ford, Denver, and Morrisville, North Carolina. Watch out for part two of Lake Norman's top six cities, the best places to live in the Charlotte suburbs where I will be talking about the other three cities of Davidson, Cornelius, and Huntersville. Did you find what you are looking for after watching this video? If you have any plans of relocating to Charlotte or its surrounding areas, reach out to us and we will absolutely help you move. Here are some videos for you to watch next about Charlotte. If you haven't subscribed yet, please click on our photo and don't forget to ring that bell button so you'll be notified every time we have a new video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you on the next video, part 2 of the best places to live in the Charlotte suburbs.